Okay, Sprint. All set for bestie day? <laughs> Do you have your list of bestie fun? <laughs> Ooh, let's see what's on the schedule. We've got running, bounding, leaping, ooh, frolicking. And later, we'll get some ice cream and read stories. But first, we picnic. Yeah! Oh, no. Did you hear that, Sprint? <laughs> that sound can only mean one thing. Sniffles season is starting. <gasps> oh, no! That means the clinic will soon be packed with sniffly animals. Ba-ba-ba-ba! I hate to say it. Until sniffle season is over, all of my attention is going to have to be on animals that are sick. Huh? I promise we'll celebrate Bestie Day once sniffle season is over. Now what should we do first? I need to make a list. We better stock up on Feel Better ice cream. Ice cream. I need to make a list of everything we need and get more hospital supplies for all the sniffly creatures. <laughs> Sprint! Did you get the sniffles, too? Bedtime! <laughs> Let's get you snuggled up in a nice, comfy bed. Now, don't you worry. I'm going to take good care of you. I know what you need. Some feel-better ice cream. <laughs> How are you feeling, Sprint? Twist and I heard you weren't feeling well, so we brought you some flowers. Aw, that is so sweet of you two. It looks like sniffle season is starting early this year. I know. And Sprint and I had a bestie day all planned. Huh? Oh. Anything we can do to help out, Danessa? Well, I am running low on feel better ice cream. I think you could pop over to the ice cream truck and pick some up from the penguins. Uh, oh, of course! Twist and I wouldn't mind. Would we, Twist? Twist? Uh, oh, no! Twist! She must have caught whatever Sprint has. Well, I know just what to do. You two need some rest and plenty of feel-better ice cream. Yeah. There you go. You two take it easy. I'll be back in a flash. <laughs> Sounds good as new. Uh-huh. Hey, Prina, Jayla. Danessa sent me for more Feel Better ice cream. Sprint and Twist both have the sniffles, so make it extra feel better if you can. You got it. <laughs> hey, what's with the tiny bell? Oh, that? That's just to attract customers. Does it work? Well, you're here. Oh, true, but I'm the only one. Your ice cream is so good, there should be a line all the way to the babbling brook. Tell you what, you whip me up a scoop of carrot ice cream for the road, and after I drop this off the animal clinic, I'll come back here to give your sound system some oomph. Oh, that sounds like a big job. And they all lived happily ever after. The end. <laughs> oh, oh my. We haven't read these in a long time. Oh, they're so dusty. <sighs> you know, I haven't heard either of you sneeze for a while. I think all of this bed rest is making you better. <gasps> Sneezy. Well then, how about some more pillows? Ooh, and ice cream. And more ice cream. Jigs and tune them to make the 
perfect ice cream sound. Jayla, give it a ring. Okay. Ugh. Oh, that was weird. Try it again. <gasps> what is that sound? I don't know, but it doesn't really make me want to eat ice cream. <laughs> Which means we're getting close. keep an eye on our besties for a while. <sighs> Sage, you're so sweet. But I'm not gonna leave the besties until they're all cured. They, uh, look pretty cured to me. Huh? They're not resting in there? <laughs> They've been faking their sniffles. Well, I'm marching right in there and telling them the party's over. Hang on, I have another idea. Uh, wake up, wake up, wake up! I was reading through my medical books and realized that you guys do not have the sniffles. You have the super sniffles! Lucky for you, I read all about how to cure super sniffles. We need to get your hearts pumping. First up, let's all head outside for 90 minutes of early morning jumping jacks. Huh? Okay, doctor's orders. Let's jump, jump, jump! Uh, 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 uh. Okay, great job, you guys. Oh, I bet you're tired. <laughs> Well, let's all head inside for a rest. Uh, hey, very good. Good. Huh? Huh? hey, guys, so Danessa asked me to take away your mattresses. Huh? The firm support is supposed to be great for super sniffles. Huh? <laughs> the fan is great for cooling down. them to re-roof the clinic? Mm hmm I told them that the high altitude would be good for them. <laughs> okay, I know those last sniffle cures weren't exactly the most fun. <laughs> but this next cure is something we know you'll love. Who wants ice cream? It's veggie mush ice cream, a special blend of boiled celery and creamed corn. Yeah. It'll cure your sniffles in no time. No, no, please, we're fine. I'm not sick. I'm not sick at all. Wait, you're not really sick? No. <gasps> you made it all up? Yes. Yeah, yeah we know. We know. No, we know. Apology accepted. Uh, 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 oh no, Danessa, you got the sniffles. Well, what are you waiting uh, for? Get down to the penguin uh, truck and bring her some feel better ice cream. Holding a craft fair at the cafe was a great idea, Jeannie. Ooh, you're full of great ideas. I guess I. Pickle and anchovy ice cream? What? <laughs> Yep, great idea. Just like getting our friends to help for free smoothies. Flick's giving painting lessons. Paint faster. 
Larissa and Ringlet are teaching yoga. Oh. And Sage and Caper are making perfume. Oh no! I doubt. Forget your empty smoothie. We're out of blue leaves. Caper. Caper. Could you grab some more leaves? And remember, don't touch the red itchweed leaves. Probably should have led with that. <laughs> Just in time. Hi, everybody. Who wants perfume? It's free. Job. Everyone loves the perfume. Look, they're jumping for joy. <laughs> they're rubbing it all over themselves. They can't get enough. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, they're so happy. They're intensely scratching their butts. <laughs> Not good. Caper, what color leaves did you put in the perfume? The red leaves make you super itchy. It's called itchweed for a reason. It's right there in the name. <laughs> Come on, we have to get rid of this bottle before anyone else gets contaminated. <laughs> there, now nothing else could possibly go wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's not your fault, Caper. It's both our faults. Well, 75% your fault, 25% mine. Oh, we gotta fix this mess before somebody gets hurt. But the only way to cure itchweed is with oatmeal. <laughs> Not to eat, to put on your skin. Hmm? It stops the itching. <sighs> to the kitchen! Vicky, <laughs> <laughs> we need a big batch of oatmeal. Sorry, I'm too itchy to cook, but you can use my kitchen. <laughs> That I borrowed from you. That's okay. I know where she keeps the lint brush. It's ready. And now for one last step. Hold on tight, Caper. Something that tastes worse than Sheenie's pickle and anchovy ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> what a perfect day for an adventure! Ready for takeoff? Safety first. <sighs> All right, let's do this. No big deal. There's no way I'm putting the brakes on this adventure. 
my clinic and have a look at your ankle. Hop out. Thanks, Sprint. I know just how to take care of a swollen ankle. Great. Catch me up, because Flick and I have a few more adventures lined up for this afternoon. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Mm -mm -mm. The only way to heal an injured ankle is to stay off of it. You need to stay in bed until it feels better. <gasps> bed? Never gonna happen. doing. Ow! Mm, just as I thought. It needs a little Wonderwood tender love and care. Now is it healed? Just a little longer. But it's already been forever. And there's nothing exciting going on around here. I think we're gonna need some help. Uh-huh. I really need an adventure. Ta-da! Adventure makers to the rescue! Keeper and I were thinking that if you can't be on an adventure, at least you can relive one. Remember these? Bloom blasts! Yep. Remember the time we found some growing on the far side of the babbling brook? <laughs> yeah. We were racing paper boats. remember the part about you winning. But I do remember when you accidentally fell into the bloom blast shrub. Ah! I meant to do that. <laughs> there were these weird looking flowers growing all over the place. <gasps> Danessa! Yeah, that's right. We decided to pick some for Danessa. Ooh, I picked the most. Mm, don't remember that part either. But I do remember we picked armfuls of bloom blasts. We never figured out what made them explode. <laughs> I think we just figured it out. Hey guys, 
Uh, you missed a pedal over there and there and, oh, and one on the chair and a whole bunch near the window. <laughs> Never fear, Sleek Beak Entertainment is here. Hi! We know you miss your adventures, so we'll help you relive a great one. Awesome, thanks! Do you remember how we needed to get across the river after that big storm? Hmm. You didn't think I could do it. It would have been easy if you could fly. Like not having wings could ever stop me. So you made your own wings. It really should have worked. No, it didn't. That was some adventure, and we did make it to the other side. <laughs> Eventually, whoa, whoa. Let's see how that ankle of yours is doing. Here you go, Vanessa. Oh, thank you, Sprint. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Ah. Hmm. Well, you just need a little more rest in bed. Oh. Sounds like the Bunny Brigade has arrived just in time. We came to cheer you up and show you my new invention. <laughs> Really new. We've seen it before. I guess you could say it's new and improved. Yeah, that's what it is. Better than before. Uh, what is? Oh, yeah, right. <gasps> suction hey. cup shoes. I love that invention. Remember how we had a dance party on the ceiling? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that we can do the twist up the wall. <laughs> and the cha-cha across the ceiling. Remember? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Until I realized I forgot to charge the stick on the grab with the whiskey and then the stickiness got unstuck. <laughs> we had to act fast. <laughs> <laughs> Did I forget to charge the double stick of a grab again? <laughs> I guess I did. <laughs> well, that was a bust. Yeah, looks like we made things worse by reminding Felicity she's stuck in bed while all the fun is happening outside. For her own good, we should stay away until her ankle is better. <laughs> I just hope these cookies put a smile on her face. Oh. You need to come to the rescue center and help Felicity. Quick, it's an emergency. Oh, what's wrong? Just come on. She needs you. <gasps> oh, you made it. Wait, you're okay. Better than okay. I'm great. But Danessa said you needed us. It was an emergency. It is. I need you to act out more of our adventures. But they didn't turn out very well. I unsuctioned and fell right on your newly made bed. And I exploded blossom blasts all over the room. Which was just what she needs to stay in bed. Huh? huh? I live for adventures, and you all brought them right into this room for me. Thanks. Now, if I'm gonna stay here until my ankle heals, I need more. Oh, yes, yes. you got it. Ooh, ooh, ooh. How about that time I made the bouncer McBob that took us up into the clouds? Or the time we fell in that hole and found all those caverns? <laughs> we went gay when we jumped off the tree. <laughs> what about that time we found those baby wrigglers? <laughs> oh, shopping. I mean, could we have a more perfect day? <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> Almost forgot the list. Junglewood Boutiques? Check. Shop till you drop? Check. <laughs> the only thing left to do is catch up with Peaky and Sheeny in half an hour, and we are done. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like someone's run out of gas. Hey, Sela, tree body. Hiya, Felicity. Oh, Flick, you look like you need a little pampering. <laughs> <laughs> tree body, help poor Flick up 
And let's get these two into the spa for some relaxation therapy. Mm, I don't know, Sela. We're meeting Peaky and Sheenie shortly. I don't think we have time. Well, sounds like you need the express relaxation treatment. Uh... Oh. Okay, the express treatment sounds perfect. Don't worry, Felicity, we got this. <laughs> now, I want you two to relax while I whip up my famous calming face mask. Guaranteed to put you at ease instantly. Awesome, I can't wait. Literally. <sighs> That was the hard part. <laughs> now to make the mask. Do this. Yeah, I'm okay. I just need a quiet place. Huh? All set. Now let's get that mask on so you can find your peaceful place. How's that feeling? Wow, this feels amazing. Now, take a deep breath and let all your troubles just melt away. <sighs> Ooh, my word, what has gotten into everyone? Look at that tree body. People rushing around getting stressed out. You know what they need? They need a nice, relaxing spa treatment at Sealers. That'll slow things down. How are you feeling, Felicity? Much better now. <laughs> Wasn't that worth the wait? <laughs> I think we finally got it. Give it a try, Jayla. Oh. That's the original bell ring. No, it's not. Listen. Yeah, that's totally the original bell ring. Oh. I, I'm sorry, guys. I feel like I let you down. Yes! I did it. <laughs> I told you I could attract customers. Sprint like
minutes to exercise after every meal. Sprint's motto is, if you look good, you feel good, and you are good. That must have hurt. Are you okay, Sprint? Right on the noggin. Yeesh. Concussion. No concussion, no head trauma, just a little teeny bump. What is that? Look, a baby porcupine. A baby fell from his nest. Porcupines don't have nests, Sprint. Whoa! Oh! <laughs> nice hat! Huh? Uh-oh. I better get him back to the rescue center. And we'd better look for his mama. Sprint, since you found him, you should come with us. Okay. Don't you worry, little guy. I'm going to take care of you like you've never been taken care of before. I mean... If any enchantable can do with a baby, it's me. Oh, please stop crying. Please. I know. Maybe you're hungry. Oh, wait. I'll sing you to sleep. Rockabye Junior in the treetop. Even though porcupines don't have nests, the cradle will rock. When the bell breaks, the cradle will fall. And down will come Junior, quills and all. <laughs> Rockabye Junior in the treetop. Even though porcupines don't have nests, the cradle will rock. When the bell breaks, the cradle will fall. And down will come Junior, quills and all. <laughs> uh, oh, I know. Uh, how about a game of peekaboo? Peekaboo! I see you. Peekaboo, I see you. Peek uh, uh, where did you go? <laughs> Junior! <laughs> Good little porcupines do not climb windows. Hey, Danessa, I need your help. I have a blister on my foot that feels like it's the size of a pumpkin. <laughs> see, it's working. My latest nostril amplifier is tracking the mama's porcupine scent. Right, Twist? <laughs> and if that doesn't work, our good old-fashioned outdoor tracking skills will be the answer. Right, Flick? <laughs> Have you been tree-leaping again, Merritt? Hey, I'm a monkey. It's what I do. Okay, a little salve and it'll all be gone and... <laughs> Junior! Vanessa, please help Flag with her knots. Hmm, it looks like a case of naughty woolatitis. Cough for me, Flag. <laughs> Junior! Ah! Ah! Okay, Vanessa, about my blister. Flag's knots? Vanessa, what about Flag? Try to taste the 
the mama porcupine scent with your tongue like a snake. What? Don't worry. We'll find that mama porcupine. <laughs> Just wait till Danessa gets a sniff of our latest perfume. Purple Potato Surprise. <sighs> The surprise is, it doesn't smell like potatoes. <laughs> huh. Still no answer. Uh -huh. I'm a warm and nurturing <gasps> deer. I'm a warm and nurturing deer. I'm a warm and nurturing deer. Aw, poor Danessa. Maybe Caper and I can help. <sighs> I don't need any help. I have it completely under control. Yes, sirree. No help. No need. I'll do it. No matter what. <laughs> ah! I think we should look in the trees. I think we should look in the bushes. Well, my idea makes more sense. Well, I like my idea better. Let's try it my way. But my way works too. Ah! Ah! Um, uh, how about a, a, a thunder enchantment? Finder enchantment? What a great idea, Sprint! <laughs> well, I'll have my moment. First, we need a porcupine quill. like iron filings to a magnet and be drawn to the mama porcupine. Follow that fluff. Come down. Come down. Why won't you listen to me? You sure you don't want our help? I, I, I. Oh, yes, please. What should I do? Well, first thing, you're thinking like a deer when you should be thinking like a porcupine. Um, which means... It just so happens I know a thing or three about porcupines having once played a really funny practical joke on a family of them that involved a huge pie, fake whiskers, and a rutabaga! <laughs> 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 uh, <clears throat> anyway, it seems that porcupines love to eat bark and will climb high into the trees to get to it. So it's natural for Junior to want to climb, and if you'd let him do it, he'd be just dandy. You mean all the crying was because I wouldn't let him do what he's supposed to do? Uh-huh. Well, I was scared he'd fall. Well, that's what would happen to me if I tried to climb that high. That's because you're I not a porcupine! <laughs> <laughs> there! There she is! Who knew porcupines could climb? Come down, Mama Porcupine! We know where your baby is! <laughs> Okay, to Danessa's. <laughs> I guess you could say all's well if it doesn't get a quill. Little guy really grew on me. Oh, there, there. It'll be all right. Yeah, I I'm sure you'll feel better in the morning. Here, have a tissue. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? lost a baby crocodile. I wonder where his mama is. <sighs> Hello? Huh? Hello? It's 
It's okay, Owl. Close your eyes so I can finish taking care of your sore beak. Okay, what is it? A treasure chest. A treasure chest? Hmm, where'd that come from? I, I don't know. That's strange. Come on, show me where. It's right! It's gone! It was right here! That's very odd. I better get back inside. That is one cranky owl. Oh, yes. there was a table out here. Yes, it was right here. Oh, my. Treasure chests and tables. You do have a very good imagination, Sprint. It wasn't my imagination. Oh, I better get back to the owl. <laughs> Who knows what else you're going to find back here? It's not my imagination. What? Hey. looked like on the inside. Yay! <laughs> Our first visitors! <laughs> Meet you up there. <laughs> Come on! Wow, those squirrels are real acrobats. But how are we going to get up there? Deer can't climb trees. Hmm. <laughs> um, I don't think so. You want to use our upsy downsy instead? Uh, I guess so, but uh, I'm not sure what an upsy downsy is. This. <laughs> oh, perfect. Welcome to our treehouse. Come on. <laughs> Don't mind the mess. We're still unpacking. Wow, you guys have a lot of cool stuff. <gasps> Ooh, look at this one. It's so beautiful. Stumper loves collecting. It's a squirrel thing. Ah! Her latest fashion is gathering shiny rocks for our mosaics. The treasure chest! Oh, the treasure chest you saw. Yes! Stumper brought that all the way from Rainywood. It was on the banks of the babbling brook. We spotted it half hidden in the mud. We dug it out and opened the lid. What did you find? Treasure? Yes, was there treasure inside? Nope. But the chest itself is a treasure. This is the perfect place for Stumper shiny stones. I like the way you think. I like to find out where stuff comes from, so I looked it up in this old book that Stumper found. Turns out this treasure chest is hundreds of years old. It may have belonged to the very first enchantimals. Wow. wow. Hmm. <gasps> oh, the last box! Be right back! We so 
still have one more box to bring up from below. Whew, we do have a lot of stuff. Find it. Though sometimes I forget where I put things. <laughs> Ta da! Yes. Hey! Wanna see the rest of the treehouse? Oh, we'd love to! <laughs> uh, that is our bedroom pod. And, uh, are you guys okay? Yeah, we're fine. <laughs> Where Stumper is. I'm just gonna swing down and see if she needs help with the box. Uh, we'll come with you. Cool. Huh. 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 Um, I think we'll take the upsy downsy. Uh -huh. <laughs> Stumper! Stumper! Stumper's not here, but the box is. Hey. Didn't you say Stumper likes to collect shiny stones? Oh, she sure does. Can't resist him. Look, another one. Ha, and another one. Ha, and another one. Huh. Looks like Stumper's gone collecting. Shall we? like the start of a new collection. <laughs> oh, I better check on my owl patient. I wonder if she's woken up yet. Yep, still grumpy. Oh, oh boy, I think Stumper's just started another new collection. Well, at least feathers make for light packing. We'll be up to get you in a jiffy! Oh! What, what in the world? Oh. Looks like you guys have another visitor. <laughs> <laughs> and now, the secret sauce for our new scent, my aroma amigo. That's that. A drop of chaos, Lily. Totally volatile, but it'll give us a real kick. Too much, and we'll sink up Wonderwood. Surprise! <laughs> 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 oh, careful. <sighs> Ooh, we got you good. <sighs> yeah. Hey, Tamika. What's up, Burst? Could one of you hand me that plant? <laughs> 
good one. Yep, gotta get up pretty, pretty, pretty early to outprank me. Sounds like a challenge. <laughs> Kiki. <laughs> we just need a few more flowers for the new scent. Keep your eyes peeled for pranks, Keeper. Count all eyes. This will scare the stink off those skunks. Here they come. Got it. Just... I smell some great blooms over there. Mm. <laughs> Now this is the perfect spot for our picnic flap. Spider! Ha ha! Got you good. Oh, sorry. Mm -hmm. Thought you were uh someone else. <laughs> Bye. This will make those two blush so hard they'll be seen from space. Here they come. That spot looks nice. <laughs> Now! Hey, room for two more? Sure thing! We can scooch down. <laughs> oh, so, so sorry. But, um, that color looks great on you. <laughs> the lilies are blooming. Come on, Keeper. They'll never see this one coming. <laughs> <laughs> These lilies are just what we needed, Caper. Hey! What gives? <laughs> <laughs> now, once Mika and Burst try to sneak in to prank us, we'll be ready. Um, forgot to close your door. No matter. Wait, we're... check on it before we... Hey, peeps! We totes called off the prank off. Promise! We know. About time. We wanted to say thanks. With pie! <laughs> we totally... Deserved that. Now, the prank off is really over! over. Um, is perfume supposed to smoke? I forgot the bottle! It was another prank, but I didn't mean to make the world's biggest stink bomb! I might have an idea! Oh, um, bye! Quick thinking, Tamika! Pardon me. Holding a craft fair at the cafe was a great idea, Jeannie. Ooh, you're full of great ideas. Agatha? Pickle and anchovy ice cream? Blah. Yep, great idea. Just like getting our friends the help for free movies. Flicks giving painting lessons. <laughs> Paint faster. Um, Larissa and Ringlet are teaching yoga. Oh. And see, 
Captain Caper are making perfume. Oh no! I doubt. Time to get goofy. Forget your empty smoothie. We're out of blue leaves. Caper. Caper. Could you grab some more leaves? And remember, don't touch the red itchweed leaves. Probably should have led with that. <gasps> Just in time. Hi, everybody. Who wants perfume? It's free! Ah! Ah! <laughs> 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 nice job! Everyone loves the perfume! Look! They're jumping for joy! <laughs> they're rubbing it all over themselves! They can't get enough! Oh, oh, oh. They're so happy, they're intensely scratching their butts? <laughs> Not good. Caper, what color leaves did you put in the perfume? Caper! The red leaves make you super itchy! It's called itchweed for a reason! It's right there in the name! Come on, we have to get rid of this bottle before anyone else gets contaminated. There! Now nothing else could possibly go wrong. Oh, it's not your fault, Caper. It's both our faults. Well, 75% your fault, 25% mine. Oh, we gotta fix this mess before somebody gets hurt. But the only way to cure itchweed is with oatmeal. Not to eat, to put on your skin. It stops the itching. To the kitchen! <laughs> Peaky, we need a big batch of oatmeal. Sorry, I'm too itchy to cook, but you can use my kitchen. <laughs> hey, that was my toothbrush! That I borrowed from you. That's okay, I know where she keeps the lid brush. It's ready. And now for one last step. Hold on tight, Caper! Oh, that's good. Oh, ew. No, it's not. That's the last of it, Caper! Huh? <laughs> Come to everyone. Oh, it's okay. After all, we finally found something that tastes worse than Sheenie's pickle and anchovy ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> Junglewood's Flower Power Festival is gonna be off the hook, Caper! <laughs> Can you believe Sila agreed to carry our new line of perfume in her spa? Soon everyone in Junglewood can sample our floral sensations! Now remember, we want to make a great impression. So be cool, okay? <laughs> yeah, so the opposite of that. You know what would be a great addition to that awesome display? <gasps> Sage Caper, you made it! Welcome to the spa. Oh, it's so soothing and tranquil. Could we try? <laughs> the 
don't we, tree body? <laughs> ah, but do. Oh. Whoa, whoa. Oh. Sometimes a little too tranquil. <laughs> <laughs> Don't mind them. They're getting the flower power special. It's our most relaxing treatment. Ooh, I see baskets full of goodies. What'd you bring us? Presenting our brand new line of organic inspired perfumes called... <laughs> Laurel Scent Sations. <laughs> I love it. Just wait till you try it. Allow me... <laughs> the stuffers jammed in there pretty good. <laughs> Give me a hand, would you keep her? <laughs> oh no! Oh, hey, that's nice. <sighs> oh, Sila, I'm so sorry. Let us clean that up. It's okay, Sage. No biggie. Just breathe, relax, while Tree Body and I get a mop. So much for making a great impression. Let's get this cleaned up before they get back. Uh, quick, grab a towel. <laughs> and we totally messed up your spa. What do you mean, messed up? The spa looks great! It smells wonderful, and I don't know how you got Larissa and Ringlet's hair to do that. But those dues are gonna be a big hit at the Flower Power Festival. And now, they smell as good as they look. This looks fantastic. Say, have you ever considered becoming hairstylists? <laughs> 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 